relay contacts silver what do these three things have in common well this relay contains these contacts which are mostly this silver right here and in this video I'm gonna show you how you can find these silver contacts and start stockpiling them and make your own silver let's get started <laughs> All right, time for a little bit of crushing your expectations. Um, these relays have these tiny little silver contacts right here, which are about 50% silver by weight, so you're going to have to do a lot of relay contact salvaging to get anything like this kilo bar of silver right here. Um, but it's a lot of work, it's a kind of fun activity, and it might be rewarding at the end. Also, if you want a fast way to get silver, probably just buying some is better. This is a relay, and this is what a relay does. No, not really. Um, a relay is an electromechanical switch designed to actuate contacts, shown here on the left, when you apply power to this blue thing, which is the coil. By putting a low voltage on these two pins right here, you can actuate this mechanical arm that goes back and forth and turns and switches higher loads. This relay is rated at 30 amps, and so it's a pretty big and beefy relay. Relays come in all shapes and sizes, though. Like this. This is a box of relays. This is what they look like. They sometimes look like this, or like this. If you break them open, you'll probably find something like this. This is the coil, and these are the contacts right here. Relays also can be see-through, and can come as large as this, and as small as this, and as small as this. So what do all of these relays have in common? Well, they all contain silver. Wait, 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 I know what you're thinking. After my April Fool's Day video where I tricked you all into thinking that there was silver in pencil lead, you don't believe me anymore. But I can guarantee you 100% that relay contacts contain silver. Basically what they do is this. This is this relay in a case, and this is the same relay without a case. If you look here on the left, you'll see that there's this copper strip with a little bead at the end of it. And there are these silver things with other beads on them. These beads have a layer of silver on them. Now they're not silver plated, but they're not 100% silver either. I'd say that they're probably about 50% by weight silver. So your goal in trying to collect silver from these relays is you want to remove these contacts. So how do you do that? To open one of these relays, you're going to need a few tools. First, a hammer. Y you get the point. Take it, smash it till the case is gone. If you don't want to smash it, pry it off. Once the case is pried off, you'll have something that looks like this. At this point, you're going to go ahead and take your pliers, and you're going to grab the contacts and peel them back like so. This exposes the silvery surface. Then bend this lead out. Then take your pair of pliers, grab the contact, bend it back and forth, until it snaps right off. And you'll have something that looks like this. Go ahead and get yourself a jar, something like this, and take your contact that you just salvaged and throw it right on in there. When you have about a jar filled up, um, you'll be ready for the next step, which is coming out in another video. So stay tuned for that. Bye everyone. Thank you all so much for watching. If you liked what you saw, feel free to click the subscribe button and check out some of my other videos.